Residents in Kamwala South near the railway lines are living in fear as the area is patrolled by junkies instead of the police to ensure people's safety. Speaking in separate interviews with Movie TV, some residents said the junkies patrol the area at night and grab phones from anyone they find in the road. Some of the residents spoke off record in fear of being followed by the junkies said they stay indoors after 18 hours as it is dangerous for them to be outside. Meanwhile, two of the victims that managed to voice out add this to say. Like my brothers who come and pick her up, that's how safe it, it's not. And um, like a few months ago, somewhere, no, actually last year, not a few months ago, last year in, Aug in September, October, somewhere there, he was coming from work, that was around 19. He had, his phones were stolen and he was badly attacked. Like he was injured to the head and he had a fracture on the leg. And that's how bad it is. They want to steal something from you, something that they've not worked for, but they want to come in and grab it just like that. Mostly it's been happening. Even our neighbors, the phones were stolen like that. They have no mercy. Someone was following me behind and then he just asked, ah, boss, na speak, huh? I was like, oh, yeah. Before I could say, yeah, na speak, huh? that's how he grabbed the phone, started running like this. There's like a shortcut that side. If you go this side, you can get a wooden junk. So I couldn't continue pursuing him. That was my second experience. Third one, my friend from that corner, they were jogging. A lady and uh, the, the guy were jogging uh, just along the same road. As they were jogging, some guys, that was around 19, I don't know, 18 to 19. Some guys just appeared from nowhere. Baba son took out my, um, something like my knife. So that's how they let go of their phones Baba pass. Those are experiences that I've witnessed, that I know about. And th even yesterday we were even talking about them with my friend. Emelda Mumba, reporting for Movie TV News in Lusaka.